<clears throat> Hello guys, this is Demi here. Welcome to Animal Crossing for March 18th, 2023. Today is the annual fishing tournament. Um, that does at least, um, That is, um, <clears throat> on the Saturday, or at least one Saturday per month, I think, in the month. In the month. It's the fishing tournament. Um, so we are done with that today, since that's the main purpose of this episode here. As you gotta fall so right off the bat. Um, last night, I actually, um, went to this uh, uh island uh and i did some minor little things but also um get some fish and i haven't sold any of them yet because i saved them for the tournament so we are doing that today just got done watching the socks the red socks uh one nine to four Against the Orioles. But I also saw the Moss too. Why? Split squad. Um, so it was um three to one at that game, but that was just the split squad, so and that was away. And uh for those wondering how I'm able to watch that game if um the main Red Sox Orioles game is the main one on Nesson 360. It's not what's the Rays versus one on Nesson. No, I had to watch the Rays cast on um, MLB.TV on my monitor. So that's what that's what I did. Uh, I saw home run, but that was all it was. So no, really much action there. On what? You no, know, very fast paced though. But you know that game ended like way earlier than the. Um, as have oils, um, which ended just before 4 p.m. So the pitch clock, you know, with that, a lot of action, like 20 plus runs, um, actually 9, 10, 12, well, <laughs> 14 combined, I guess. Um, you know, the pitch clock is a uh, Beautiful thing for baseball. I'll, I'll just say that because who would want to go through a four plus hour game, like for example, where Sox race, you know, with like no score or whatever, and just you know, a waste of time. At least to start out from your team. Um. So, I mean, I get the whole thing with um. Like Pete Rose used to talk about all the time. If there was a uh, four post hour game played so many innings, and you're so, um, I mean, if your team wins, you're happy as the H word all the way home. But if it's like a two, two, uh, three hour game or three, and your team lost, then you're upset as. Out of my home, so I'm mean, I can agree with that statement right there. But um, the pitch clock, I think, it helps the pace of the game, and I love it. You know, I've been looking forward to this coming to the major leagues for a while. Um, I can't remember what year exactly they started to use it in Triple A in minor leagues. Um, but um. <clears throat> No, it's a great thing for baseball, and I'm glad that baseball is doing it. Because, like I said, who won't watch a board game for four plus hours if you're, especially a 162 guy or girl, you know? So, um, whoops, no, it's okay. Um, and plus, it helps um, it helps your sleep, uh, sleep schedule too, as far as I'm concerned. 
You know, you could just watch a game 7 to 10. Or even 7 to 9.30. Um, and then just go to sleep like that. You know what I'm saying? So, and you'll have time to watch, if you really want to, the West Coast games. Um, so, could help a while for you. So, that's what I like about the pitch clock a lot, and I think this is great for the game. Um, and I heard about it after the lock, the 99 day lockout, they were to do, do it next year. It's just, I know I was happy. I'm a big fan of the pitch clock. Um, but there's one thing about what I don't like is that the uh, the ghost rule, the one on second base and extra innings. I I don't know if I would say a fan of it or not. Um, on one hand, I can completely understand why they wanted to do that during the pandemic. Um, but um, I mean, I can. I mean, yes, you don't have to play two plus innings like the Astros, Manners, Red Sox, Dodgers in the playoffs. Two years apart. Let's see what um, fish I got here. I'm just um, no. Um, this is good. Wait, that just got two. Okay. Um, but you know, sometimes you know at the ballpark, you might want to stick around for a little longer. So, I mean, um. I'm just honestly, seeing it, you know, especially with the pitch clock now, I'm not a huge, a big fan of it. Um, so. Alright, let's see. Oh, oh, a horse map will bring it to me. So I, I think it's time for the um I uh hey, um I forgot what it was. Um, do I have to stop this video? I pause it just to like go back. I really don't want to. Um, but it looks like I have to. So, um, I'm just gonna pause it here and I'll get back. All right, I'm back. So apparently, it's about the this month is all about the uh, horse mackerel. So. Um, do I have that on my hands? Nope. Let me, um... <coughs> Let me just check around and, um... He's fishing. <laughs> All right. Oh, rats. I don't think I have one. Um. All right. So I have sharks. So let me try that. Uh, 
Seriously. All right. I guess that won't work. So, um, I guess what I'm gonna do now is, um, I'm just gonna sell everything I have. Let me just do that here real quick. So he's only looking for the horse, which I thought, but I was, I was just, you know, point back at me. I was just, uh, You know, I was just wondering, you know, is that like even the case? I just want to test it, but all right. So let me just sell all of the stuff I have because none of them is the horse mackerel. But speaking of which, I'm just seeing. Year. Oops, I've done it. I want to see you, please. One thousand six hundred. I just I'll keep this camera on me while <clears throat> I do the rest of the selling, and then I'll just you know, kind of hungry right now. <laughs> All right, um, let me just uh, continue. Continue with selling. Okay. Okay. Get out of the way. Thank you. And now, for the trip to sell everything. By the way, I am done. Uh, I'll put all my episodes of both the Pop Cup podcast and um Nice Talk Football to schedule um for March thirtieth. And now it's up to the thirty first. Let me just sell one more thing. I just wanna see how much it costs. Look at this. Look at this. This is like going to Nine thousand bells for that deal. That is worth a lot of money. Um. So yeah, last you know, I just got done last night. I bought all the episodes for the um uh, or scheduling all the episodes for Dust Talk Football and the Pop Up Pan Podcast to Spotify. You know, schedule starting at 5 a.m. March 30th um, until 
I guess you could say around 2 p.m. And then after that, it starts talk football. So it's pretty much all day. You know, so until well after midnight for that stuff football. So that would be from the to the third place. So that's the plan. Which I did, so Alright. So I'm gonna make the final stop for fishing. Okay. By the way, once I reach the twelve thousand bells uh goal, I'm gonna make another series. Another gaming series. And that you know what I'll see right here. It's Tomodachi Life. I haven't done that game in so long and I just thought, you know what? Until I get that twelve not twelve thousand but twelve million goal, then I'll start a new Tomodachi Life series. Cause I don't need to Go back to the beach every night and just continue getting stuff to sell. So that's what I'll do. So uh, now let me just get coupons here. Up to forty one. Now what I'm gonna do now is go back to my house, and we are going to. Get that fishing pole. And we're going to start. Alright. There you are. For the uh, horse thing, so um, okay, let's uh, let's test it out, okay? All right, please just get these one fish, All right? Well, wow. oh, okay, here we go. All right, let's see what it is. Oh, rats. All right. Not my one to see. Okay. Just got to keep finding it. Gotta keep finding it. Oh, that. Empty can, come on now. Uh, wonder how much that's worth. Uh, I just need to find. Nothing much going on.
Boop. Not quite. A right, new catch. Boop. Yes, sir. All right. That's what I'm talking about. Put that down. Wow, it's a new record. <laughs> All right. See what's going on here. Nothing. All right, so I'm afraid that uh, we may have to pause this here yet again because, um, unfortunately, we have to wait until at least 6 p.m. So, uh, you're just going to do that and, um, yeah, so just gonna have to do that. So we'll see you in just a few hours. <laughs> Just uh, let you know, I completely forgot to change my microphone audio. Um, so we're back. I'm gonna have to edit this. Um, so here's what happened. Um, I'm completely sorry for I forgot to change the microphone. Um, here's what happened. <clears throat> um, I forgot to change my clock. So I had to do it an hour forward. So um, yeah, I am. Um, I'm sorry about that. Um, but you know, we're back. We're back. Um. Okay, so now, like I said, I'm completely sorry for the first for the microphone. I completely forgot to change it. Um. So, uh, <clears throat> all right, um, we're done with that. Um, so we get some coffee. Let's do it. I have like 12 minutes left before it hits seven, and um. um I have to go to the beach soon. And I just realized, since I changed the clock and all that, just maybe I can fix it a little bit 
by uh, just changing the times for me going to the beach um, when like if I'm want if I want to go to the beach to get it done in the afternoon or whatever um I could do that but uh I don't know we'll see we'll see what happens we'll see what happens going forward I just don't wanna do anything bad to the game that I'm saying but um you know I think I could maybe possibly do it um is there anything else in my nope um but I think uh before you finish this off we go to Club L. Is it open? Yes. Oh, come on, get that way here. <laughs> Alright, so that's gonna be it for this episode of the Macross Scene and Folk um Monkey Mimo. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time. So have a good night everybody.